everyone, it's Pastor Justin here coming to give you a preview of what this Sunday is all about. First off, Danielle Hillier, better known as Danny, will be in the pulpit this Sunday here at Grace at 9 a.m. and 10.30 a.m. continuing this sermon series called Wilderness. And in fact, she is going to be doing a sermon called Be Wildered by wilderness and she will be taking us into John chapter 3 verses 1 through 17 now, I don't know about you but this is an awesome story this is the story of Nicodemus okay he is the guy who came and visited Jesus at night okay he was part of the Jewish scholarly class a Pharisee a teacher of of the ways of God from the Old Testament and he comes to see Jesus at night and he asks Jesus how how can I get this life how can I understand what you are about and Nicodemus is looking for concrete answers very very concrete answers about this new life this renewal for his people and Jesus keeps hitting him with bewilderment keeps hitting him with wonder language keeps hitting him with enchantment type language this idea that the spirit of god is on the move that the spirit of god is in the wind that the spirit of god is involved in our birth in a new birth that's from above that's again and again and renewed over and over again so much so that jesus gets into how moses was out in the desert and the people were dying and the people looked up and Moses creating this brazen snake for them to all look upon for their salvation. And then comes the most famous lines in all of scripture. Whoever believes in him will not die, but have eternal life. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believes in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. For God sent not his son into the world to condemn the world, but that the world through him might be saved. And this is the crux of what Jesus is trying to get to with Nicodemus, right? Why is Jesus in the world? So that the world might be with God. So that the world will be saved. And Jesus says, I haven't come to condemn the world. I haven't come to create judgment in the world. I have come so that people might have life. And Jesus says another spot in the Gospel of John, that they might have life more abundantly. This is the point of the Gospel. This is the point of wilderness. This is the point of going out and discovering some answers aren't just easy, Nicodemus. Some answers require a bewilderment and wonder and enchantment before you get what the Spirit of God is up to. Hope you'll join us this Sunday at 9 a.m. and 10.30 a.m. with Danny preaching. Thanks, everyone.